Most of us have all flown at least once or twice in our lifetimes, if not more. And of course, safety is always the number one concern when flying. At least for me anyways. But what we don't often think of is runway safety, a critical part of operations and a top priority for airports. Incidents including foreign objects on the runway, bird strikes and other issues can provide imminent dangers to the operational integrity of airports. And that's where Excite Systems comes in. They provide incredible tech to keep airports and passengers safe worldwide. And here to tell us more about it is Alex Cohen, CEO of Excite Systems. Welcome. Thank you. So let's jump right in. Can you tell us a little bit about Excite Systems and what you do? Yes, actually we are an um, Israeli uh, high tech company. Um, we bring artificial intelligence to deal with the tiniest uh, objects over the runway. We uh, detect all kinds of uh, threats over the runway. And uh, we bring, uh, we en enhance the capacity and the safety of the runway, and therefore the operational capabilities of the of the airport. Mm -hmm. And therefore, we uh, bring to less accidents and save lives. Very important Very <laughs> thing important. to do. Yes. Now, let's talk a little bit about the the risks that you mentioned. What can happen on the runway? I mean, I'm not really familiar. I think of you know, when I think of airplane safety. I think of takes offs and landings, of course, mm -hmm. and in the air, but we don't think of the runway itself. So can you tell us a little bit about well, the risks? When, when you think about the runway, you, you can think about foreign object debris, tiny metal objects, which, for instance, brought to the uh, uh, Concord catastrophe on 2000. Mm -hmm. That's where the whole idea of bringing on the high tech of Excite Systems came up. Mm -hmm. And uh, we also detect uh, uh, birds. We can tell between a bird and a foreign object. Mm -hmm. We can tell w whether it's icy over the runway. Mm -hmm. So we, we prevent excursions, runway excursions. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and we also do s different kind of surveillance over the runway. So we are there. We are over the runway. And Therefore, we do all needed in order to bring better capacity and safety to the airport. And do you have any statistics sort of off the top of your head that you can say, you know, how, how big of a risk is this? Well, it's a very high risk. Every 10,000 movements, there are four foreign object debris over the runway. And 10,000 so, movements, you mean either landings or takeoffs? Yeah. Okay, so I'm curious about the history of the company, when it was established and where the idea came from. Well, the idea came from the Congo catastrophe. Mm -hmm. The founders, they both were uh, Israeli Air Force uh, veterans, mm -hmm. and they started to develop the idea throughout the years. And we were established at 2005 and overcome all FAA uh, uh, testing, mm -hmm. and we far exceed their regulation. And then uh, we came to our products. Our first product was the FOD system, which detects FODs. Foreign object detection foreign object, system, yeah, okay. For, for object detection system. And uh, we added all applications in order to uh, bring the, the, a comprehensive solution to the, to the problems that each op uh, operator faces. And I understand that now you work in airports around the world, right? You have a number of airports that you're in. Yeah, of course, we are very proud. Recently, we have won a tender in Beijing Airport. It's the second most po uh, populated airport congested in airport in the world mm -hmm. after Atlanta's. And uh, we are uh, deployed already in Seattle Airport, in Boston Airport, and uh, Bangkok Airport, and uh, of course, Tel Aviv Airport. And we are uh, collaborating with the uh, Israeli Air Force, and uh, also we have been collaborating with the U.S. Air Force also. And this is tech that we should hope or expect to see in, air in every airport around the world eventually. Of course. We are sure of that. Great. Well, Alex, thank you so much for taking the time to speak with us today. Thank you.